Hi everyone. So welcome to the new session. Okay. So yeah, new class as well. So in the last class video, right? So I told you uh, we need to handle one more condition for the employee year of experience uh, whose uh, work experience is greater than 14. That is nothing but uh, 14 to 20 years of work experience, right? So how to handle that? Because in in the last class, like if it is greater than 14, also we got uh, senior manager right so the new case we added is like if the employee year of experience is greater than 15 and within 20 so like we are giving a role called director so how to handle that and I think none of you uh, set a correct logic in the last class and uh, also I wantedly done a mistake but none of you have catched it and none of you have uh, reported it back to me right so yeah but I'm just going to reveal the solution for that so find the employer of experience okay yeah so the solution is yesterday we added and operator here that is wrong you should add or a logical operator okay and also yeah you need to add one more condition to handle this which is nothing but if they are 15 and if they are in between 20 yeah we are giving the role called director got it so this is the solution for the yesterday's question and this is the solution for yesterday's assignment yeah thanks so anything else yeah so we will try practically okay so this is the PS file and I'm just changing the year of experience to the 12 and 13 right uh, yeah I'm just changing it to 16 and 15 year so 16 and 15 okay the employee role should be director okay and for the 12 it is senior manager and for the 10 it is manager I'm just giving 14 year okay I'm just giving 14 okay let's see what is happening um, okay uh, let me submit the job okay the job successfully submitted so we got uh, max is zero now go to the output file so the logic is working correctly right so for the 12 years the role is nothing but senior manager and for the 15 and 16 years of work experience the role is nothing but the director and for 14 also senior manager okay now let me change the last one right to 10 or 11 okay I'm just updating it as 11 so the role will be manager right yeah I'm just submitting the job yeah the condition code is 0 so no need to worry you can see manager is updated so yeah so I am also giving the solution for the assignment I am giving so you need not to worry if you are not even able to complete it if you have doubt yeah please ping us we will reach out to you and yeah we will start the new concept right in Java I think how to handle the exception right so yeah we will start that so next video is yeah next part of this video is java exception handling yeah now we are jumping from mainframe to java so yeah because java is also very interesting programming language in the world but mainframe is also interesting and then it is like it is like a monopoly right in the legacy projects so yeah you need to learn both the things that's it yeah now jumping to the java